Good morning guys, today is a day I'm jumping 15,000 feet out of an airplane. I'm feeling very nervous. Uh, we're on the way to Salisbury now to go skydive. That's the name of the company and we're going to skydive. George is driving me out there today. Say something. I can't, I don't know what to say. You're a vlogger. I know, How do you not know what to say? I'm nervous for you, but. I think you're more nervous than I am to be honest. I mean, I'm really nervous, but I know that the feeling's gonna be amazing. I have to keep telling myself that. But um, yeah, I think you're more nervous watching than I will be jumping. Well, neither of us have done anything like this before, ever. Um, I keep asking myself, would I do it? <laughs> the answer is a no. I I mean, everyone I've told about it, they go, oh, is George doing it with you? And I'm like, uh, yeah, no, like, well. God, no, no chance. You'll be absolutely fine. It, it'll be amazing. Yeah, and um, I'll probably want to do one after you do it. To the rest. I'm just having my last breakfast here. Your last breakfast, <laughs> don't say that. Um, we went to the petrol station to fill up the fuel and I've got some uh, blueberry and a raisin yogurty muesli thing. Um, I don't know if that was a good idea, but I feel like I need to eat something before I go. And then before I get out, I'm gonna have a Red Bull, so I've got my more energy to give me wings, as they say. Uh, and George is making me feel sick with his breakfast. We sit half six in the morning, we go into the petrol station, George picks this out for his breakfast, an egg sandwich, what is wrong with you? Well, I, I don't wanna smell that this early in the morning. I'm trying to be a bit healthier, because I actually went to the gym yesterday. Shock. I didn't want like a pastry, I didn't want a pasty is healthy. thing. Yeah, I didn't want that healthy. I've got to get there at nine o'clock, so my arrival time's like just before nine. Apparently, they like they can't give you an exact time as to when you're going to jump, but in the nine o'clock group, it'll be within like a few hours of nine. Sat now saying we're going to get there at half eight, so plenty of time. Um, there's no traffic on the roads; it's so early. It's a Sunday morning, so I think we're going to be all good. If you're as confused as I am right now as to why I'm doing this, um, if you haven't been watching us for a few months, two months ago I put a video on here um, saying why. So it's basically, I'm a finalist for Miss Brighton and in that process you have to raise money for these two charities, the amazing charities, the Connor Saunders Foundation and Amanda's Angels and I'm here today, I've raised over £500 so far and it's still going up so when you're watching this video if you do want to sponsor me there's a link below. And I thought what's going to raise the most money, what's the most extreme thing I can do within reason, I thought a skydive's probably a good example of that so yeah. I've booked a skydive a couple of months ago. Literally it was well random, wasn't it? I was like, yeah. wanna do it? Yeah, shall I do it? All right, booked it the same day. And now it's um, crept up all of a sudden and, and here we are. Here. And we can see the plane. Oh my God, okay, plane's just going Oh my off. God, it's blowing. What is it doing? What, what is happening? Why is it moving? So that must be a few It's people. so wobbly. Oh Jesus my Christ. God. It's, what it's is it doing? As well. The really good news here, guys, is that we don't have to worry about filming because the guys here at this company, um, we told them we'd be making a YouTube video about it as it's for charity and everything. They decided they would give us their film package, chuck it into the deal. So the whole thing, when Luce is up there, is going to be filmed from properly, floor, professionally. From the floor to the plane to ceiling and back, when back down again, it's all going to be filmed apparently. So. Yeah, so she'll have like a GoPro in her face when the wind's going like that. I don't know what I'm going to do when you're in the air. It's going to chill. Right, here we go. Ready to check in? I think so. How are you feeling? Really nervous now. Are you? Yeah. I want to do it. You don't. It's easy for me to say that, but you know. Just arrived, yeah, and have you checked in on the iPads yet? No. Okay, so you should have a wee ticket number. I do, yeah. We're going to do that and then we're going to do that. Thank you. So I, 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 there goes a sign for my soul. my induction I'm now waiting for my name to be called I'll go into that white tent to be kitted up in my overalls my helmet and my goggles um, and then it's happening I don't know how long I've got to wait for it but they said to have something to eat I've only eaten that yogurt this morning um, and they said that if you don't eat you're more likely to be sick so with that in mind I think we're gonna get some food now I really want to do it I know you keep saying that I, I wish I kind of bought it for you and all the training and all that induction it he was so crying fun. with laughter from the oh, guy the guy was hilarious it's, really it's like stand up comedy yeah. just to relax you I yeah. guess my last meal before the flight <laughs>
bit of beans on toast. We were advised to get Lucy some food. So obviously I thought I should as well. Sa you like little sausage bat. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Best for both of us. Wow, I'm seeing it. I can actually see people falling out of the sky. It's crazy. I've just been called to the marquee, literally taking my last mouthful of beans on toast and I've been called now. Whatever they said. Um few quick facts. I'm falling from 15,000 feet. I'm going to be travelling at 125 miles per hour and I'm going to be free falling for 60 seconds. Wish me luck. So she's gone off to get her outfit put on and everything. I don't know if I'll see her now before she actually goes up in the plane. Just as excited, for a bit less, just as excited <laughs> being here and watching and her actually doing it. So she's all strapped in, ready to go. <laughs> Suits you. There you go. The guy saw me making a video and let me into the pit where all the jumpers fit into. No one else gets to go in. No one else gets to go in this bit. So very lucky. This is all strapped in. How are you feeling? Ready to start the training. I'm excited. Yeah. So like an intruder in this one. You're a bit. All of my normal clothes. How are you feeling? Ready to go. Yeah. They've given us warnings about if the airplane crashes. So. Oh good. Well, at least you got a parachute on you. Exactly. Right. I've got to go wait in here. Okay. Good, good luck. Hang on, wait. There you go. There we go. Jumpers only past this point. Oh my god. It's happening. It's actually happening. How do you feel? Mm. I'm really looking forward to it, but I'm also like, oh my god. The guys in there told me to get the guy to make it fun, so it'll be like spinning loads, so we want to have more of a fun free So I'm going to be watching you like spin around, I'll be like, oh my god, what is going on? Yeah, never done anything like it before, something I've always wanted to do, so no, I'm just really looking forward to it. Sounds really good, and who's this you've dragged along with you? My boyfriend. And is he the cause of this? He's not actually. He's not. He's probably more nervous than I am. <laughs> then I will be up. Rather you than me. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> I've raised money for two charities the Cornerstone Owners Foundation and Amanda's Angels, and the finalist for Miss Brighton. Brilliant. Wow, what a fantastic yeah. course to do it for. How much have you raised so far? Yeah, over 500 so far. Brilliant. Counting. Still counting. So uh, people watching at home, put your hands in your pockets. Yeah, keep raising money. <laughs> we're about to kick her out of a plane. I mean, there's no, there's no bigger thrill than that, really. <laughs> yeah, exactly. And if you want to leave a message for people back at home, what would you like to say? Uh, it's been nice knowing you. Um, <laughs> well, you seem pretty chill, and I think he's, uh, he's more nervous than you are. <laughs> but yeah, we're going to see you over 15,000. Do you recommend it to anyone else? Everyone, yeah. 100 percent everyone. Amazing, how was it? Was it good? Really good. Was it? Amazing. Really? <laughs> I couldn't tell who was who. No, I was first. I was Wait, first no I was way. Oh, I did I watch you then. All filling out the plane. Yeah. I was the last one to sort of get on. Yeah. Like, there was like not even a bench for me. I was like, oh god, I guess I'm going first then. Really? It <gasps> what was it like sitting on the edge? 
it was like a second on the edge. That wasn't the, that wasn't the scope. It was more like the build up. Were you it. suddenly falling? Yes, what was it like? Just literally go upside down. Could you see on, anything? Yeah, oh, my teeth were hurting because I was smiling. Really? Like, you like laughing almost? Smiling the whole way down, but I've got sensitive teeth so that cold air is freezing. The cold air is smacking in my teeth. And I was like, <laughs> Did it feel fast? It looked so fast. So it was so fast. scary yeah. to watch. It, the minute went really quick though. And Good morning, so Skydivers. And then could you relax a little bit in the parachute Yeah, well, no, because then I asked him to, to have a bit of fun sort of thing. So he gave me the controls and I was doing the parachute and then no. he yanked one down and I just went like this. Really? And, I was like, mm. <laughs> and could he talk to you? Could you yeah, hear him and stuff? Not in the fall, but once the parachute had gone out, you could. And it probably yanked so it. When I down, I had my back click as it went. And I was like, oh, God. Oh, God. <laughs> no, it's crazy. Well done. Ta -da. Back in your normal clothes. Not even sweaty. Look at that. Yeah. Amazing. <laughs> Has it sunk in? <laughs> what do you want to do now then? You can't really top that today, can we? What should we do? Bungee now? Yeah. yeah. Just got home, guys. Lucy, very deservedly, if that's a word, is having a bit of a chill out session on the sofa.